Attention to sense perceptions. Attention to sense perceptions. Conscious looking around. Either at one thing or the totality of things. Conscious looking around and not interpreting, just looking or listening. Sounds or both together. Conscious and you're taking it all in. But refrain from labeling it. You don't need it. So instead of looking through the world through thinking, you look at it against the background of presence or awareness. And then you can sense, and let's do it right here now. It's the room. You're perceiving the room. The things in the room. And as you become aware of these perceptions, the things that you perceive, there's also the sounds, the voice that you hear. There's something else then. There's not, that's not all there is. What you see in this room is not all there is. You can also become aware of the space in you that makes the perception possible, which is the presence that you are, the consciousness that you are. And that is the background. So in a way, one could use the analogy of whatever you perceive is what's painted on the canvas of life. It changes all the time, it's not fixed. There's the canvas of life, and that's the, all your sense perceptions. And then you become aware that beyond all the things that appear on the canvas of life, more essentially, you are the canvas itself, and that is consciousness. And so you become aware that you are conscious, and there's no content to it, it's just the spaciousness, like this room. You become aware of the space in this room, by becoming aware of the space in this room, you become aware of the inner space of consciousness, unconditioned consciousness. Another way you can do it is through auditory, as a, to use auditory perception as a doorway or gateway. And especially when you go somewhere where it's totally still silent, it could be at late at night when you're at home, and most humans have gone to sleep, or it could be you're out in nature, and you can see, you suddenly become aware that there's a silence, silence all around you. We could do it in this room, although the silence is not total. There's a little bit of probably air-conditioned or whatever noise is there, but there is still some silence. So when you become aware of silence, you're not thinking. Becoming aware means basically you listen to the silence, although there's nothing to listen to. So we're using auditory perception as a doorway into presence. So when you're listening to silence, you're basically listening to no thing, to no thing. And so what's left when you listen to no thing, it's just, you become completely still inside. You cannot think and listen to silence. You can't even be aware of silence when you're thinking. And because most humans are so trapped in thinking, they actually they actively dislike silence. They feel very uncomfortable in silence. They can't stand it. So they make as much noise as possible. And our civilization, technology has create, created innumerable devices that make it very easy for you to...